dear students now you are going to learn about second algebraic identity that is x minus y whole square is equal to x square plus y square minus 2xy let us see how x minus y whole square equal to x square plus y square minus 2xy Now, draw a line of length x. This is a line of length x. From this line of length x, remove a part of length y so what about the length of the line remaining that is is equal to x minus y because whole length is x from that we removed y so the remaining part is of length x minus y Now, make a square with side of length x. This length is equal to x. That is x minus y plus y is equal to x. Now the square is completed. This is a square of side length x. Now divide this square into rectangles. Now the square is divided into four pieces that is four rectangles. Now area of the first rectangle that is of length x minus y and breadth x minus y. So the area of the first square is x minus y whole square that is x minus y into x minus y x minus y whole square. Now look at the second rectangle. Here, this rectangle is of length y and breadth x minus y. So, the area is x minus y into y, that is length into breadth. Go for the third rectangle, that is of length x minus y and breadth y. So, area is x minus y into y. Now the fourth rectangle, length y, breadth y, so the area is y into y, that is y square. Now, x minus y whole square is equal to, to get the square of area x minus y whole square equal to to get the area of the first square, we have to remove second, third and fourth part from the bigger square. Bigger square is having area x square minus 2 times of x minus y into y minus y square. So x square minus 2y into x that is minus 2xy minus 2y 
into minus y that is plus 2y square minus y square. So x square minus 2xy plus 2y square minus y square that becomes plus y square. So x minus y whole square is equal to x square minus 2xy plus y square. This is the second identity.